So you're watching this video going, the title says why YouTubers love the Galaxy Note 9. And you're asking yourself that question, why do they actually love the Galaxy Note 9? I'm, helping, I'm here to help you answer that question because I reached out to a couple of my YouTube buddies to say, hey guys, why don't you let people know, at least through my video, why you love the Galaxy Note 9? So instead of me rambling on, let me just jump in and let's find out what some of them actually think about this lovely device. What I really like the most on the Note 9, and there's a lot of things to like about, is the camera. To me, as somebody who likes to shoot video and pictures, camera is at the forefront of any smartphone, and the Note 9 does not disappoint. The dynamic range, the overall quality and stabilization you get is impressive. In fact, I did a video with the Note 9 versus my Sony a7 III, and the outcome is pretty insane. If you guys wanna watch it, I'm sure there will be a link down below. What's up guys, Matthew Monas here, and thank you E for having me on. My favorite feature of the Galaxy Note 9 is definitely the display. Every single year, Samsung has the best display on a smartphone, and the trend continues this year. Peak brightness has been increased. Think about it, Galaxy S7 Edge came out a few years ago. That display is still better than half the smartphones that are currently on the market, and the trend continues with the Galaxy Note 9. Watching media, consuming media on this device is absolutely awesome. What's up everybody, this is Danny, and the reason why I love the Note 9 is because you can do a lot of epic stuff with it, like take it on a helicopter like I'm about to do right now, but what I think is that it's the most complete smartphone on the market right now. What other phone can you find for $1,000? I know it's expensive, but with a beautiful display, great dual cameras, you have a huge 4,000 milliamp hour battery, you have dual speakers, you have a headphone jack, you have water resistance, you have everything that you would want in a premium flagship phone. So that's why I love the Note 9 because I think it's the most complete smartphone that's out on the market right now. Hey everyone, it's Jaime Rivera with Pocket Now. E as always, thank you so much for having me. One of the things that I love the most about the Samsung Galaxy Note 9 is its approach to productivity. Things that begun since the Galaxy Note 8, like for example in cases like App Pairs, where you could set specific combinations of applications to launch at the same time in multi-window from the edge screen. I have my combinations already set. These have followed me since the Galaxy Note 8. They came with the Galaxy S9 Plus as well. But now with the Galaxy Note 9, you have a taller display. You have the advantage of the S Pen to be able to interact with some of these. And then the fact that you have more battery life, just the whole combination makes this pretty much the whole package for me. Again, E, thank you so much for having me. Power user. It's a term we used to use to describe people who use their smartphones all the time, for everything. And it's those people that the original Samsung Galaxy Note was built to satisfy back in 2011. But in 2018, everyone is a power user. And so the Galaxy Note has had to adapt. What's impressive is taking a photo and then getting told by the Note 9 that someone might have blinked or that the shot was blurry. You might want to take it again. That's the kind of feature that helps real people shooting photos in the real world. These are not real people in the real world. They're tech bloggers in a fake living room at Samsung's New York headquarters. But I'm showing you these shots because they're all self-portraits I took remotely with the new Bluetooth-enabled S Pen. You just pop out the pen, you point the phone at yourself and click away. Now my favorite thing about the Note 9 has to be that screen high resolution AMOLED display, and it looks really good. The colors pop, the blacks are super deep, and you have the option to fine tune how it looks. If you think it's too punchy, you can make it a little bit more basic if you want. And the screen is the thing that you interact with the most. So if you have a nice screen, then odds are you're gonna have a nice user experience as every time you interact with your phone, you're interacting with the screen. So it's Dave from The Unlocker here, and some of the things that I like about the Note 9 um, one is the S Pen and the fact that we have like that Bluetooth technology which is great for doing like selfie things but not even just that like they're gonna open it up it's gonna be an API you're gonna be able to do a whole bunch of other things with different apps which I'm excited about it's just it's just different and it's one more thing that makes like the Note 9 better than some other phones I also love the camera it is the S9 plus camera so it's not anything new but it's nice to see it on a note that battery is finally note sized it's a 4,000 milliamp battery 
which we haven't had last time because of a certain problem with the battery. <clears throat> so my favorite feature on the Galaxy Note 9, hands down, has to go to the display. And I say that without even getting into like the tech specs of it because you can just look at it <laughs> and appreciate it in all of its beauty and all of its glory with this like bezel-free screen. And it just really makes you appreciate any video or photo that you're looking at on this phone. And that includes <laughs> the photos and videos that you take of your own. So to me, it just checks all the boxes. You have a screen that's not only big, but also super sharp, bright, and saturated. So yeah, I think my favorite feature definitely has to be the display. Hey, it's Joshua Vergara. What's going on, everybody? And I think the reason why I like using the Galaxy Note 9 is because it can handle pretty much any task that I throw at it. It's great for media consumption because of this awesome screen, and the S Pen now has a remote shutter button so I can use it for my vlogging and for my photos, and of course the camera is already pretty great. And I think one underrated feature of it is the cooling system that makes the processor stay as top-notch as possible, even with heavy gaming. This is what a $1,000 phone looks like when it can literally do whatever you need it to. What's up guys, Saf here from Super Saf TV. And what I most like about the Samsung Galaxy Note 9 is that it's a great all-rounder. It ticks all of the boxes. You've got an amazing display. You've got great cameras all around. I'm actually filming this on the Samsung Galaxy Note 9. You've got lots of storage, including expandable memory. Uh, there's fast charging, fast wireless charging. There's the all-important S Pen. And this year, we've also got great battery life. And that's why I like the Samsung Galaxy Note 9. Thanks for having me. This is Saf from Super Saf TV. I'll see you next time. So there you have it guys, there are a lot of opinions on why the Galaxy Note 9 is a device that they do like. Granted, it costs a thousand bucks, it can be expensive for some, but they've mentioned, of course, my friends have mentioned a bunch of different reasons why this is a device that they really like. Now, uh, if you haven't subscribed to any of these guys already, uh, go ahead and do so. I want to thank them very much for helping me out in this video. I'll also leave the links for their own Galaxy Note 9 reviews and videos in the description, so definitely go check that out. Now, on my part, what I like about the device, uh, of course, is its versatility, but for me, it's the S Pen. Uh, I really have been using the S Pen for a long time with all Galaxy Note devices, but this one feels much better to write on, taking notes, even just doodling or doing stuff on it. Also, the ability to use as a re remote control, I think to me, is really awesome. But this is not my review, guys, so stay tuned. In 30 days, I will give you my long-term 30-day review, which is what I usually do, so stay tuned for that. But again, I wanna thank all my YouTube buddies, so um, go check them out, watch their channels, uh, subscribe, and also don't forget to like and share this video, guys. And definitely, if you haven't subscribed to Border Work, do so right now and hit the notification icon to get notified with our latest videos. This is Thunder E saying thank you and always enjoy your entertainment.